Are you ready, Clara? Norlin? We are indeed. Okay. Um, welcome, everybody. Um, we're doing Scandinavian dances with, taught by Norlin and Dave Parsons with music by the uh, fabulous Clara Byam. <laughs> Live music, no less. So, <laughs> Hey, Norlin. Not, she's not dead yet. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, could you hear me? <laughs> Just checking. Uh, greetings, everybody, and thank you for coming to our dance session. And I uh, have a wonderful uh, partner here, um, Dave. And um, we wanted to do a little turning dance, and um, but we didn't want to make you all dizzy and fall down. Um, which is easy to do when you're dancing alone and turning all by yourself. I know you remember when you were little kids. Um, <laughs> and there has been a dance that hasn't seen a lot of press or popularity that I've noticed. Um, we learned in 2001 from Ingvar and Sally Sodal when they came here for our August camp. And the name of it is West Trondelag Pulse. So I guess there's a town in Norway called West Trondelag. And this little dance comes from there. So, um, and so it's not a lot of turning and, I, and it's not as hard as some turning dances, but in case you have sharp corners like coffee tables and you're going to be dancing near them and getting dizzy, just be really careful, put a pillow there because um, we don't want you to hurt yourself. So we're gonna demo this dance, we'll do a short demo and then we're going to break it down into parts. Let's start this way, here. That's all we need for our demo. We have a wonderful mu musician uh, here by the name of Clara Byam, if you have not been here before. And she has a newsletter that she sends out sometimes about things that she's doing. So you'll want to be uh, a part of that. We can, we can hook you up with that. So um, the dance, um, and again, I, I think I want, what I just wanted to say is I love the sweet music, the tune, and um, anyway, and the dance I like very much too. So. Um, you're going to take two hands, yes. So uh, we're going to break down just that introductory part, which um, I'm going to step on my right foot. He's going to step on his left foot and just swing, just a step swing. Step swing, other foot, step swing. Let's do that again. Make sure you got it. And mm -hmm. step swing and step swing and, because it's in threes, and now we're going to do step, cross, step, cross. And again, those crosses are on three. So the music is going one, two, three, one, two, three. And so you're stepping on three. So that much, what we're going to call the lead in here, is it, uh, we're going to do it again. Step, swing, step, swing. Ready? together and step swing and step swing and step and cross step and cross and now we have the man step which is a little bit different from the woman's step the woman's step is like cake i'm going to pass a microphone to dave and let him talk you through the man step but i'm actually going to put it on him <laughs> <laughs> uh chat amongst yourselves for about 30 seconds <laughs> <laughs> I've grown too much hair <laughs> thanks to the pandemic. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Man step. Uh, again, the theme is it's one, two, three, and you're rotating. And the first step in the rotation is the left foot coming around. Step two is just a touch to take up that beat and then you step three is in the line of direction that you're wanting to rotate so it looks like one two three one two three one two three one two 
three, one, two, three. And maybe a little music. Sure. To show how that. Does it matter which part? <laughs> okay, great. Uh, I'll do the lead in and then I'll do it. So okay. I'll start with the lead in. So, I don't know how else beyond that to describe it. Uh, <laughs> yeah. If you have questions uh, during the teaching, you can send them to me or to the full group, and I'll make sure to pass it on to these guys because they can't see the chat, but I'm watching. Yep, we see no chat. Um, so, the lady step, you're going to love this because it's just straightforward, um, is... Step on one and three, one and three. So you make a full rotation, but you're just stepping twice. And so it's one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. And we won't make you do it more than four times so that you don't get dizzy. <laughs> um, and then we'll stop and do the lead in step. So um, do you want to do that with a wee bit of music? Sure. Okay. So I'll do the intro. Step swing and step swing and step and cross step and cross step and three one and three one and three one and three. There you go. Step and cross step and cross one and three one and three one and three one and three. And so if you were at August camp in 2001, you might have learned this dance, um, but you might have forgotten it. Um, but it's one of my favorites. You might be 19 years old. And, and we. <laughs> <Sure>. <laughs> Sorry. Yes, you might be 19 years older than you were then. Um, so, again, I just want to remind you the name of the dance was Trondelag Pulse. And it is from Norway, just in case Clara's parents, who have Norwegian ancestry, are watching. I just wanted to point <laughs> that out. Um, so, West Trondelag Pulse. And so now we're going to do it separately. So you can role model with Dave or with me if you want to do uh, his part or my part. They're very similar, but he has a little bit different footwork. And then we're going to talk about doing it together. Ready? Cool. Step and swing, step and swing, step, cross, step, cross, three, one, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, step and swing, step and swing, step and cross, step and cross, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, so now, uh, any questions? Good. I can't see. Any questions? Nope. Oh, excellent. So um, if you have a friendly broom or kitten or um, another item that you wish to dance with, a teapot even, or if you have a, happen to have a handy human, um, <laughs> we'll talk a little bit just for a second about hold. So after we do this introductory step swings and step crosses, step Cross. We are going to just slide right on into social dance position. We're going to keep our my right, his left hands joined, and my hand is going to go on his shoulder. If we can stay connected here, it adds frame and is helpful, and his um, hand is on my shoulder blade. And so we go into our rotation, which is one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. And my hand is firmly on his shoulder so that I'm going with him when, wherever he goes, basically. And as he mentioned, because they can hear you if you talk. As your, I mentioned what? Your, oh. foot, your footwork is? So the, we keep our feet fairly close together. We stay on top of our feet. We don't do a lot of flailing around. Ah! We keep it tight. And keep my it tight. first step, when I'm on two, I'm really between her feet. And then I come around, and then I'm back between her feet, and I come around, and I, and end up. So you can see how tight we are. We're not, we're not keeping, you know, we're not going wild. Like we're just keeping it really close and tight and straight up. 
keeping your footwork small, yeah. right? And my one is as tight between his feet as I can get them and be comfortable. Okay, so um, if you are doing it solo uh, or if you have an object or a friendly person to try this with, um, let's walk it and then we'll try it with music. So to remember the lead in, we're going to do a step swing and step swing and step and cross step and cross step and turn step turn step turn step two three and then we and then we bust apart again uh for the for the intro or lead in step one last thing about getting into the turning part is i essentially make a move in front of her on that last after that last step which is part. not hard because you already have this hand I have to keep that hand but i move in front of her so she knows it's something different. Yeah. We're going to start turning. Yes. And it's pretty choreographed, so there's not a lot of following. Um, so, West Trondelog Pulse, um, let's try it with music. Yes. Oop. <laughs> Have a hand for Miss Clara Byam on accordion. And that was West Trondelog Pulse. So we hope you didn't get too dizzy. We hope you enjoyed that. We think the tune is very cute. Um, so we're going to move on and do a little bit of Schottisch. Um, we were talking about whether you call it Schottisch or Rhinelander. Um, it may depend on the music, it may depend on where you're from. Um, but there are lots of different versions of Schottisch. <laughs> Thanks, Dorothea. It was lots of version, different versions um, in lots of different countries. Um, we were pointing out that linguistically, Schottisch kind of points to Scotland. Rhinelander points to Germany. Uh, there are Mexican Schottishes. And so um, here we are. The Schottishes, do you want to talk about your music? Uh, I'm playing, I've got two Schottishes here so we don't get bored to death of the cuteness. Um, <laughs> these are both, uh, I believe, Norwegian-American Schottishes off the Brentson Band album, uh, which uh, Andrea Hoag um, was, uh, was one of her early projects, um, as far as I understand. And so I've got the Iowa Schottish and the Maple Grove Schottish. Um, sure. Can we have a, scooch? a yeah. little bit of a, a, a scooch? A scooch. <laughs> A skosh? <laughs> <laughs> And so what that looks like is, and I need to step forward a little bit, is one, two, three, hop, one, two, three, hop, one, hop, two, hop, three, hop, four, hop. But 
You'll notice when I say hop, I'm not hopping. I'm doing a little lift. So hop is just easier to say, please forgive me, but I'm gonna use that term. But we're not leaving the floor, so it's not technically a hop. I know better. <laughs> Rose, a couple. You start with outside feet. And, oh, good point. So I'm gonna start with my right foot, and Dave is gonna start with his left foot, so he can follow either one of us. So here we go, basic steps straight down the hall. And a one, two, three, lift. Two, two, three, lift, one, lift, two, lift, three, lift, four, lift. I train myself to say lift. Um, and so that's the basic step. If you would like, you can add a turn. So we might go uh, on, on the lift, on the step lifts. We go straight on the one, two, three hops, and then we do uh, turns. I'll do, I'll do 180, you do 90. <laughs> and one two three lift two two three lift one hop two hop three hop four hop it's just easier to say so um we again don't want you to get dizzy and so you can turn i like holding my arms out because even pretending i have a partner helps me balance so um, you can turn step lift 180 degrees step lift 180 step lift step lift so i can do uh, a 180 each step lift or dave is going to demo you can do come this way a little bit they can oh you can do a just 90 degree turn St step lift step lift step lift so you can just turn a little bit so that you get all the way around and time to go in line of direction by the time uh it's time to start the basic step again okay so um together. together so we might um we might take a position like this with my hand on his inside shoulder it's your inside shoulder yeah, on your waist. and his around my waist and so we might go forward one two three just going to go straight two three lift one lift two lift three lift four lift and then we might turn around and come back to you <laughs> so do it with us one two three lift two two three lift one lift two lift three lift four lift and then we might um start here and then let's do the first part one two three lift hold right here because we're going to face each other all of a sudden on that last lift and take a handhold these hands don't change much. Your hand comes up, doesn't it? I've got a shoulder blade and a, and a below the shoulder. A bicep, kind of. Yeah. And I have a shoulder blade and but a, but a, but a, but kind of a bicep hold here. And what's important is, again, to, to keep this connection here, assuming you feel comfortable doing so with this person, and I hope so, and uh, here as much as possible. So then we're going to turn. One or two, uh, 180 or 90. Uh, 180s okay. and step lift step lift step lift step lift and that's the turning step so we'll come back to you and we'll do straight one two three lift one two three lift and then the turning step like we do here we go and a one two three lift one two three lift step lift step lift step lift step lift and of course, you might be going around a circle in line of direction. What are we uh, leaving out? We talked about the hold. Um, so let's do a little bit of that, okay? Together, uh, solo or together with your broom, mop, or partner. Yes, we're gonna mix it up. And a one, two, three. One, two, three. Thank you. 
So now that you have the basic, and again, if you have questions so far, please write them in the chat. Clara will see them and uh, let us know that you have a question. So we appreciate this dynamic here. Um, we thought we'd go on to a couple of variations. We have three variations in mind, depending on whether we run out of time. So the first one I think of as the diamond. Dave calls it away and back, I think. Um, so if you are connected, how do you lead? We would I lead this by after we do the the lead in the one, two, three, lift, two, two, three, lift. I slide this hand over to the opposite shoulder blade. My other shoulder blade. Not a shove, but a, a little guidance out. Like a that. guidance away. So I go one, two, three away, and then I come back together. So let's back up to the camera and show that again, just the away and back. So away to three and back together, and that's the diamond pattern. Then you do your step hops. Let's, let's demo it going this way. Ready, and away to three, and together to three, and step, lift, step, lift, step, lift, step, lift. And so that would be our first variation, either away together or the diamond, because I think of it as you're going away and then coming back together, making a diamond on the floor. Shall we try that with music? Just a few, just a few rounds. Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> And which polka was that? Uh, Iowa Shottish. That's the Iowa Shot polka. <laughs> that was the Iowa Shottish Clara is playing there. Um, so we have a way in back for another variation. We might want to do what we think of as the rollout. Um, so here he's giving me a little bit of a rolling push, same shoulder blade. So instead of pushing like that, I would guide her through like that. Like and that. Either way, he's getting rid of me, which I think must be a therapeutic feeling, but, <laughs> but, but I digress. <laughs> so here we go. He's going to roll me out, and one, two, three, and here is an optional clap. Clap, two, three. And it's really cool if you clap at the same time. <laughs> so, so on one, that's right. So it is, it is. Roll out two, three, and clap two, three, and step, pop, yada, 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 yada. One more demo, and then we'll try it again with music. And roll out two, three, and clap two, three, and step, pop, step, pop, da dum, bum, bum. Shall we try that with a little music? All right. Roll out, or you can work on the diamond. Let's start with the basic. Oh, we're going to start with the basic. I've rolled you out. If he's rolled me out, he has to anticipate so my <laughs> positioning so he can, so I don't yeah. end up with some other partner on the floor because, you know, um, that's always a possibility. So how, how do we anticipate that? Uh, you so intuit it. <laughs> so, so turn, so turn away to three and, but we have a few steps to get back together yeah, here. Connecting. Clap to three. We're looking for each other to get back together. Yeah. Always looking for what we have in common to get back together. <laughs> I'm going to turn this into a therapy. Um, so, yes. Practice the first two moves. Out and back and the turn. 
Um, what time is it? Just checking. Uh, we have time. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we're going to have a, a little bit of practice time for you for, with those first two variations. And so we have basic and we have variation one, which is away and together, or also known as the diamond. And then we have this rollout turn. So a few bars of music to practice those. And we'll mix them up. We'll start with basic. Musician. How'd that go? I'm sure it was swimming, and I hope nobody's dizzy yet. Um, so we have one more. There are many, many variations, and you can just take this as far as you want to. It's way fun. Um, we have one more to present to you. Um, it has a name, and we've forgotten what it is. <laughs> so we're, we call it in line. So here, here's how it goes. And again, it's in place of the one, two, three, hop, two, two, three, hop. So um, he, we're going to both turn, and then we're, it has a couple of slaps, uh, ankle slaps. So it's turn, two, three, slap, step, slap, side, close. Hard to do in slow-mo. We're going to talk it to you again. I'm turning to my right. He's turning to his left. I'm starting with my right foot. He's starting with his left foot. We're going to turn, two, three, slap. Do that. Turn, two, three, slap, step, slap, side, close. So there is another turn in there. We'll show you where it is. We'll talk it slowly. So do turn, two, three, slap, and pause. Turn, two, three, slap. So I'm slapping my left foot. He's slapping his right. And that's the next foot that's going to move. Right. That's the next foot that's going to be put down. And, but I'm going to turn while I do that. Step. And now we're both facing away from each other. <laughs> Face away. And then I <laughs> slap my other foot. He slaps his other foot simultaneously. <laughs> and then you finish turning around to face and do a side close. And that side close is your opportunity to reconnect so that you can do your step lifts or step hops together. Okay, so let's do it together. I mean, us and you at home. Here we go. Turn to three, slap, step, slap, side, close. And then we connect for the step, hop, step, hop. We're gonna do it again. And. From here, we would just, it's kind of the, the, the push off again. The push off again. You might want to do an audible silently and to your partner. An audible is always good. Like, let's do in line next, okay? <laughs> or a shorter version. In line. And then one, two, three, slap, step, slap, side, close. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> I need water. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I lost my water. <laughs> Sorry. Mm. Mm -hmm. And the microphone's attached to your face. Dry. <laughs> yeah. Dry here in New Mexico. Um, so since we lost the thread there, let's do it one more time. And we're going to try to do it together a little bit faster because the music goes a little bit faster than what we've practiced it. Ready? And turn to three, slap, step, slap, side, close, connect, da, 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 da. Again, turn. Whoa, hi. <laughs> I didn't tell my partner. Ready? We're going to do that again. And turn to three, slap, step, slap, side, close. Da, 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 da. My observation as I was just doing it is um, 
even though I said you're facing your partner here, you're really turning the whole time. One, two, three, slap, step, slap, side, close. You're turning until you get to the side, close part. So if... A bit of a blind reconnection. So sometimes you might crash. <laughs> sometimes you might be a little too far apart. You crash gently, though. <laughs> and, but that side, close is your opportunity to find your partner and connect. Okay? So can we slow the, slow the music just a teeny tad mm -hmm. so they don't fall over at first? Yep. So we're going to try the inline move, which has a name. And somebody could post it in the chat if you know it. Okay, thank you. One we didn't make this one, up. One standard. Start with a standard. One stand, one basic, yes. Yeah. Inline. for everybody let's have <laughs> it's clapping yay <laughs> wonderful um let's have one more tune during which you have options to do um basic um diamonds mm -hmm. um roll out with with or without the clap and uh, what we call in line and yes one more tune Okay. okay, I already switched to Maple Grove, so You're we're we're stuck in it. Oh, goody, Maple Grove. <laughs> yeah, Maple Grove Shottish. All right. Which uh, is, I'm told, a Norwegian American tune. So, I think yeah, I think happy. that whole album is Norwegian American stuff. We're happy here. Yep. Okay. Uh, all right. I'll, back to slightly faster. Sure. <laughs> for the Maple Grove Shottish and Clara Biome. Okay, and um, so we have one more quick thing to present. And um, this is, you don't need a partner, uh, no way, no how for this one. It's called Long Dance, a uh, couple different spellings, depending on how I want to find it in my computer. Um, <laughs> we believe this is from Sweden. And um, we think that we learned it from Tommy and Ava England, uh, who were uh, very popular Swedish dance teachers uh, a while back. And I went to review the dance, and I found our wonderful Rue Lester <laughs> demonstrating this on YouTube. Thank you, Rue, with the same music that we have known and loved. Loved. Um, I just want to mention there are different ways to get in touch. There's albuquerquefolkdance.org, which has a, a, a whole list 
of ways to get involved in folk dancing. And I um, can't remember. There's a Thursday night group. I don't think they're Zooming, but the Santa Fe and Los Alamos groups are Zooming on Tuesday nights if you are interested in any of those. So there's that info. Um, so this dance, again, it's a line dance, and it leads to the left. So um, Dave is going to be kind enough to let me lead here. Well, it's because I have the microphone. And um, we're going to connect kind of like that teapot hold, do, 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 like this. Actually, let's go that way so we can face the camera. Do, 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 do. <laughs> and the steps are quite simple. It's just step and step. It starts with the left, that's the hardest part about the dance. And you do this uh, 16 times to this wonderful tune that is very ear catching. And then after 16, you take a bigger step with a step, lift, step, lift, step, lift, step, lift, four of those. And then you do two of the basics, step and step. And then you do the big lifts Four more times, da, 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 step, step. And that's the dance. Long dance uh, from Sweden. Franz Solaren. Franz Solaren, or something like that. I <laughs> yeah. don't speak Swedish, but we love them. So <laughs> with music, join us. Yeah, so this is uh, the original recording that we use and have heard is like beautiful droney fiddle stuff. Uh, I'm not a fiddle, but I'll give you some drones. So here it is. It's beautiful. Uh, in one of the recordings, the dancers were singing along. It's a very beautiful melody. So here we go. Clara's amazing on her accordion. <laughs> <laughs>
a big hand for our wonderful musician, Clara Byam. And I hope, thank you all for coming and joining us today. That was called Long Dance uh, from Sweden. Long Dance Franz Oleren. If you listen to the YouTube enough, you, or the music, you, <laughs> you know how to imitate, maybe. So again, thank you for joining us for West Trondelag Pulse and the Schadish. And I hope that, <clears throat> and uh, Long Dance, and I hope that uh, we can put our arms around each other, you know, soon. So be good, be careful, and take care out there. Thanks, everybody. Thanks for coming. Thank you. Oh, we're a little early. I muted you. Oh, you muted me. No, you're not muted. So we're a little early. <laughs> Did you want us to repeat anything? Do you want me to say that again, Deb? <laughs> go ahead. Yeah, go ahead. Uh, see um, I said we're, we, we ended a little early. I didn't realize uh, how early it was. Would you like us to repeat anything? We could just put on some Schottish music. We sure could. Or some Trondelag music. We have. Yeah, let's go back and do one more. Uh, review something. Which yes. one do you want? <laughs> Thank you, Carolyn. I heard, I get a yes. <laughs> Thank you. Schottish? Both. Sure. I should have grabbed my book, my other book, oh, but sorry. here we go, back to Iowa. Iowa Schottish. Right. Thanks, guy. Thanks for your feedback. <laughs> Clara, how are we doing on time? Do you want a little West Trondelag? Let's do it. Two more minutes. Yes. Yeah, Dave, yes. Dave is in, yes? Yes. Yes. In love with this move that um, you don't let go, but you turn like this. It's called Stigar. Also, we learned it from oh, Ingvar yeah. Sodal. And I think it's when I discovered the real magic um, in Schottish, the infinite variations and the, just the amazingness about it feels wonderful. So when we can get together, we'll do that. We've got one minute. Whoa, one minute. One, one minute time, worth of one time through the tomb. One minute worth of trondelog. <laughs> <laughs> Besides Clara, our wonderful, wonderful musician, I'd like to thank Deb and Tom and um, 
uh, all the people that Gretchen and Lindsay, Lindsay and uh, Peter and Erica and all the people who've worked hard at putting this together. So thanks. Thanks, guys. Until next time. Yep. Bye.